we're going to go into a crossover progression that will eventually lead to breakout crossovers accelerating out of the zone. But the very first thing we need to do is we got to reverse engineer it and we've got to get Franca working on not the over, we got to work on the under, which a lot of players are locking, right? So when you're doing your crossover laterally, the over is a piece of cake, but a lot of players stand up, they get zero push, if any especially when you go into your quick feet. So I want them to learn right off the bat to have the muscle memory to work on stretching, have power, and extend through the under. That's what makes the difference. So, Franca, you're gonna stand here. Go. Nice and slow and low. Dramatic and slow on purpose. There you go. Awesome. Those are beautiful. Good push. So then we're gonna keep adding to the progression, right? So now we're gonna stay inside the zone and they're gonna work on using all of this ice inside the blue line to extend that under push. But we're gonna get two birds with one stone. They're also gonna work on their upper body, right? We all know what the under is doing, but the upper is just as important. So if they're doing crossover that away, guys, I want stick position in. I don't want it driving behind and I don't want it directly out front. I want it straight in, kind of 90 degree off your body, and I want eyes over the inside shoulder, right? So you've got one here, go. I want to see that under. As as you can. Right, ready? One lap around. Kicks in, eyes over the shoulder. So we're going to our backhand. Us righties have a tendency to drop that inside shoulder. So Frank and I are really gonna have to work on keeping that inside shoulder up, which anchors you into your edges, right? We don't wanna lean down so far. We're taking energy and power off our edges inside. Make sense? Then Austin, he's gonna be doing one hand looking over this shoulder with the lefty going this way. You guys ready? Yep. Low and dramatic, get that under. Stretch that under. 